What up, everyone? Welcome back to Blade Bias. Christmas happened a week or so ago. Hopefully, you all had a good holiday. And I managed to snag this. This is a case made by a collaboration between Will Hirsch and my case builder. And I want to go over it today because these things are really, really cool. And I really like them. So this is the Echo model. This is the protective, waterproof, airproof case that holds 10 battle songs. And there they are in all of their glory. This is featuring all of my metal battle songs along with my favorite plastic one currently, which is the Calico. And of course, you got Carbon Honey, you got the Bally Driver, and you have my wonderful Damascus Kraken, which I'm not going to open because it's too constricted. But I just wanted to take some time because cases aren't usually something that get full reviews on YouTube. I thought I'd take my time to say what I thought about it because overall I'm incredibly incredibly pleased with this thing the foam feels nice um the little Will Hirsch thing is cool I want I hope he does like a little pin or something to go there my one major complaint I will say is that carbon honey doesn't necessarily work with this right here because carbon honey has this weird cap and it is impossible to get any grip on it because you can't really push your fingers in too far because it's it's such a thin there we go it's such a thin little like there's no space in between the walls and this so this cap specifically this is all you have to grab onto and this is extremely slick i don't have my car or my canto group with me it's at my apartment so i can't test it with that but carbon honey can be a little bit of a pain to get out other than that Everything in this is really, really great. Um, I have thick ballast songs in here. I have the Firefly V2. I've got the Calico. Um, and it really is holding up really well. The only thing that I will say is that I think it's holding up well because um, you can see how much this foam is being compressed by the fact that I have two thick ballast songs on this side. So having the thin Nemesis in there is probably helping out a lot more than I'm than I'm really realizing. Although that could probably be solved by just moving one of these up here. Or it'll definitely be solved when I no longer have this in there at all. So, um, yeah. Otherwise, these things are really, really great. I like the orange. The orange helps. I was kind of, I have to admit, I was a little skeptical on the orange. Um, I was like, oh, I would know if I didn't have a ballast song in there. But it does make it incredibly obvious that they are, they're missing and that you, you need to find one if you're at a place like Blade Show. Um, it is also very nice to have a place to store my ballast songs that's actually secure and that I would be okay putting on a plane or maybe in a suitcase or even bringing to places like, I know Will tested them at the beach. I have no idea why you would bring a case like this to the beach. But I would be perfectly comfortable doing it because they're really, really durable. Now, since I get a lot of questions about this, this is my old case. This is the Vault Co. case. They are, you can see I've got a few things in here. Um, they're pretty durable. They hold a lot. But they aren't the most protective because it's just a soft, just a soft case. You can get one of these really cheap. I think this was like 30 bucks on Vault case.co or something like that so this is perfect for carrying like between like oh i'm gonna go to, to ty's house you know when i could and he didn't live in florida and i'm just gonna bring this but having a place like this to store ballast songs that's legitimately like protective and i feel comfortable um having all my ballast songs in here is really really nice and i also want to shout out the latch mechanism is just the most satisfying thing ever. You know, I'm not very well versed in like hard gun case type things like this, but just the way that they like, the way that they latch, the way that they unlatch is so satisfying. I find myself sometimes just kind of like messing with it because it's, it's literally, it just feels really nice. Um, foam up here, very squishy, very protective. There are a few indents. Um, the Carbon Honey, I think, is indenting, and also the Firefly is pushing in on the top. But, I mean, that's literally what foam is for. It's supposed to compress. And the foam in the walls in between the ballast doesn't feel like it's going to rip or anything like that. 
Uh, I do wish maybe it was a little firmer so that it didn't flex as much, but I understand it's soft foam. So putting in thick ballast songs like the Firefly and the Calico isn't really going to be helping you out too much on that front. But other than that, I really have no complaints. This little storage pocket is amazing. I have all kinds of stuff in here from little cleaning things to my zippy caps, bite handle indicators, these cloth carrying pouches, my Kraken anchor, the Bally driver, stickers underneath all of that. I love being able to carry oil, like actually carry oil in its own specific place. And of course, the display, but this display, what am I saying? The display slot is awesome. Um, I know Will did like a poll at some point to see if people wanted more storage or a display spot in one of the cases. I don't remember which case exactly it was, but having a display spot like that to put your most prized ballast on is is really really great i actually really enjoy it can put the uh the nemesis there and put the kraken in there maybe if i wanted yeah it just looks really really nice i am extremely extremely pleased just be careful of these bite indicators the bite indicators get caught a lot and i feel like one's gonna rip eventually um but we'll see but yeah really really nice cases happy to finally have a nice protected case and i mean look up here this helps you visualize kind of color combos on balisongs green arctic or a green and blue handled arctic would look so nice holy cow that would be so nice anyway that's my case that's what's in it the only thing that's going to change is that the bermuda is going to go bye bye uh the firefly i'm going to get my vortex back probably sell the vortex as well and then down here, I'll probably put like the, maybe the cycloid and maybe like a reaper if I buy one, because the reaper is really the only thing that I'm gunning for right now. But yeah, other than that, this is my case, my case tour. And uh, go check out a Will, Will Hirsch case. He's got a bunch of, partnered up with my case builder, he's got a bunch of different styles that you can get. So if you want a less protective one that holds more, you can do that. Or if you want a more protective one that holds less, you can also do that. Although I don't think, I think it's the same level of protection. Anyway, I'm rambling at this point. When am I not? Thank you all for watching. And I will see you all in the next one. Peace.